Adam, it's so cool to talk to you again. Tell me what, why you're here at Dragon Fest. Well, thank you so much. Yes, Dragon Fest is the annual expo for the martial arts industry. It is the Martial Arts History Museum's special fundraiser. And I'm very honored to be here um, supporting the Martial Arts History Museum, but also to gather with fellow martial artists. Uh, we get together, we talk, we train, we have a good time, laugh, all that great stuff. And um, tell me about Doc Savage, what's going on with your series? Yeah, so we have a brand new streaming series. It's going to be coming out very soon. We're negotiating right now with one of the major streaming platforms. Uh, we'll be making an announcement very soon on where that'll be coming out and when. Uh, Doc Savage, Man of Copper is our new streaming series inspired by the original Doc Savage from the 1930s Pulp Fiction novels. And then seriously, why should we watch Doc Savage? Well, because it's a really fun show. We have a really great cast, some terrific actors from Central Valley as well as myself and Americus Abasamas, who plays our main villain from here in Los Angeles. How'd you get Americus? He's cool. Yes, he is. He's great. He was cast at the same time I was. The executive producer, Chris Mackey, actually came to Dragon Fest two years ago, saw us both here, approached us about playing these roles for the um, you know, hero and the villain of the new Doc Savage series. When you're here at Dragon Fest, what's the top things you guys talk about? Oh gosh, um, everything from you know getting together with old friends, talking about previous training experiences and fights and, and movies, but also to plan for the next. That's really what's great about Dragon Fest. It's an opportunity to reminisce, but also to plan and strategize for the next great successes we're going to have in our industry. Out of all the Dragon Fest you've been to events, what's been your best memory of Dragon Fest? Well, guys, I actually went to one of the very first Dragon Fest that Gerald Okamura put together. And I did a demonstration, I broke, broke a bunch of bricks, and uh, it was a lot of fun. We really had a good time then. My last question is, Adam, how do you stay so positive with all the stuff that you do? <laughs> Well, I believe in the uh, five principles of the Savage family. It's actually part of my martial arts training is the principles of the Rainbow, of the Rainbow Warrior martial arts. And we, these five principles drive me, inspire me, and I, we incorporated those into our streaming series. Actually, what we did, we took those five principles and we made them the five principles of Doc Savage. So you'll hear those when you watch our show. Wow, very inspiring to me. And yes, I've been sir. friends with you for a long time, so thanks for being my friend. Absolutely, brother. I appreciate you. And wishing everybody out there a fantastic day. And go train.